Welcome back friends and today I want to go over the upward strikes or the upper twirl for the, for the step. So let's go over a few things to remember is you want to have a foot forward try not to have a try not to have your feet parallel with each other because this gives you an awkward position and your spinning will be will be kind of off will be thrown off also so for demonstration I'll have my left leg in front but if you like if it's more comfortable you can have your right foot it's okay so a few other things to remember is that uh, you want to have your hands as close together as possible not like this because it's you're not going to be able to have a nice crisp clean twirl with and you're going to be bumping into your arms so you don't want you don't want to do that so hands close to as possible and your hands Try to have them in the middle of the staff. So this is what I can, what I believe is the middle, close to the middle of the staff. And I'll start with the staff with the right side of my body. So think of four strikes in one whole twirl or one revolution, one full revolution, or a, you can also think of a figure eight. So nice and slow, I have the staff here, my left leg in front, and I'll count it with, you can count with me, with the four strikes. So it's coming under, one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. And I'm so think that the if you're holding the staff on the right side of you and the bottom the bottom of the staff or the end that's closest to your foot is coming up is one two and it's going on the other side of your body and then coming up again three four so you can see where you have you need your wrist nice and loose and subtle so you can spin this staff Try to concentrate on a you know on a spot or on an object in front of you, and that should be your target for both ends of the staff to strike. So again, a few things to remember also, or to go to remember, is that you need to have a one leg forward, your hands in the middle of the staff, and as close together as possible, and your wrist nice and relaxed, and your shoulder relaxed, and use your hips also. And you're coming under the four the four strikes. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Like I say, you wanna try not to swing it all over. Pick a object or a spot on the wall and focus on that target. 
So my target is you, the audience, the camera. Well, obviously, I wouldn't strike. I wouldn't strike you because you're good people. And there you have it, friends. The upward strike, or the upward twirl strike, or the upward figure eight. There's many names for this, but just want to go over the foundations and how to get the maximum speed and power for the upward staff strike. Thank you, friends. And until next time, have a great day.